What, what we're going to attempt to do here today is uh, demonstrate how we'd put a splint on a, a lamb's leg. And this lamb's leg obviously isn't broken, but quite often they broke, break right in the area that I'm pointing at. And uh, that's really a rather uh, easy type of fix. If it's higher uh, in the in the femur up there, that's more difficult. But those sometimes can be fixed also. And you, but you want to run your uh, tongue depressors so they go out beyond the joint there, so you still have movement in the joint and try to get pressure points above and below the break. Uh, I like to use vet wrap. It's real. We use vet wrap and tongue depressors. Pretty simple deal. It's important that you get padding so the tongue depressors don't uh, rub in through the skin or the hair and uh, cause irritation. But you simply wrap this, and you want to be careful. It needs to be snug, but you don't want it too tight. If you get it too tight, you get swelling at the bottom of the foot after several days, and you'd have to redo it. And uh, we'd like to avoid having to redo it if we don't have to. And you notice I've placed that tongue depressor. I left some blue above the the thing so it wouldn't dig into the sheep skin again. And then we simply put a tongue depressor on each side and just continue our wrap and be sure that we get it fairly tight on a couple pressure points below and above the break. Really simple procedure, and you know, it's it, it's a rewarding situation. Those legs don't always come out perfectly straight afterwards, but I've got a ewe that's probably broke her leg four or five years ago, and uh, she's nursing triplets this year, and her leg's a little crooked, but it don't bother any. In this particular instance, we'd have to cut those tongue depressors off if they're a little bit too long on the bottom. Now, when you take this thing off, you can take a hook blade knife and go cut right over that tongue depressor. You won't cut into the deal and then peel that off. We'll take it off the other way because we put it on and it isn't sealed up and isn't tight yet. But probably after leaving this on two, three weeks, uh, three weeks preferably if you're not getting any swelling. And, uh, and they may, when you take it off, if they're putting pressure on it, you're in good shape. There's, they're not completely healed then, but young lamb, they'll continue to heal and they'll be just fine if they don't get bumped again.